Did you hear that Linda Hamilton is reprising one of her most famous roles? Don't with me! That the first trailer to the Tomb Raider reboot dropped? What about IT director Andy Muschietti's potential new Stephen King project? Yeah, I saw him too. No? We've got you covered. Welcome to The Cinephiles, a weekly show where we zoom in on the most buzzworthy news Hollywood and the indie scene has to offer. It'll be an adventure. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. Number 3. Linda Hamilton set to return to Terminator franchise. I'll be back. So will she. After last appearing in Terminator 2 Judgment Day 25 years ago, Linda Hamilton is officially making a return to the iconic franchise. You're the one living in a fucking dream, so I'm in, cause I know it happens! It happens! According to The Hollywood Reporter, James Cameron, who himself is introduced back into the franchise for the first time since T2, announced the casting at a private event promoting the sequel. Cameron hopes to not only recapture the classic Terminator spark, but to show audiences and Hollywood that there's place for older women in action movies. Get out of the way, John! Shoot! There are 50-year-old, 60-year-old guys out there killing bad guys, but there isn't an example of that for women, Cameron said. With Hamilton, Cameron, and Arnold Schwarzenegger already committed, the original trio look to recreate the magic missing from recent installments. I think you're so creative. You don't know what it's like to really create something. Deadpool director Tim Miller is set to direct, but he and Cameron are keeping details of the story tightly under wraps. Trust me. Number 2. First Tomb Raider trailer drops. Out with the old and in with the new. Well, I could certainly think of one person I could do with that. Ugh. Oscar winning actress Alicia Vikander makes her debut as the famous Lara Croft in the first trailer to the Tomb Raider reboot. What's your name? Lara. Surname? Croft. The film, which is based on the 2013 video game of the same name, follows Lara Croft who after her father disappears, goes to the island he was last seen in order to uncover the mystery of the tomb called the Mother of Death. Our world is in danger. As the trailer plays through, the mystery begins to unfold, with Croft solving complex puzzles, discovering secret layers, and watching hidden video left behind from her father. Eventually, Croft sets out by boat, but becomes shipwrecked when a storm hits, leaving her washed ashore and captured by a group who seemingly know her father. You shouldn't have come here. <gasps> but I'm glad that you did. The trailer is loaded with classic action-adventure stunts and set pieces, which look to make Croft's attempt at saving the world all the more spectacular. Tomb Raider is set for release March 16th, 2018. Can't be too careful these days. The world has gone bloody mad. I'll take two. Before we get to our final entry, here are a couple new releases. <laughs> So I face the final curtain. Call Bobby. Tom, it's on. Every time that so, Billy Jean, what do you want? All these lines, Whatever I may feel, I can't act on it. There's too much at stake. Number one. Its director Andy Muschietti looks to remake Pet Cemetery. Got that right. Looks like it director Andy Muschietti isn't happy with directing only one Stephen King property. With it still crushing box office records, Muschietti also made waves when he told Entertainment Weekly that he was interested in tackling another Stephen King adaptation. Um, yes, please. The iconic Pet Cemetery. Entertainment Weekly reports that Andy and his sister Barbara Muschietti are both giant fans of the book, who have been eyeing the opportunity to make a film. If we do it, we have to do it justice like we did with it, said Barbara. The versions, the scripts we've read, have not been, in our opinion, representative of the book. Andy isn't the only director interested in helming a Pet Cemetery film, however, as Guillermo del Toro once tweeted about how he would kill to do it. Before Andy gets the green light for Pet Cemetery, he still has to wait for the go-ahead for IT Chapter 2, but after its box office and critical success, it's all but guaranteed. I'll get you. Enjoy our entries? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.